In this tutorial, we dive into the process of updating Alama models, ensuring you are running the latest versions. The curl command downloads the installation script from Alama and pipes it to the sh command to execute it, installing or updating the Alama client. The if statement checks if the command Alama is available. If not, it prints an error message and returns a non-zero status, indicating an error. The setl command assigns the output ps auxgrep alama serve to the variable alama proc. This command checks if the alama serve process is running. Another if statement checks if the alama proc variable is empty, indicating that alama serve is not running. If so, it starts alama serve in the background using alama serve and. If alama serve is already running, it prints a message indicating that. It then echoes fetching list of alama models to the console. The script initializes an empty list variable named jobs. It runs alama list, processes the output to exclude the header, and then loops through each line. Inside the loop, it extracts the model name from each line and attempts to update the model using alama pull dollar model name and. It adds the process ID of the update job to the jobs list. After updating all models, it waits for all update jobs to finish using wait dollar job. Finally, it prints a formatted list of Olama models. If you like the content, hit that like and subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.